Hey everybody, this is Beat the Bush. Today we're gonna to talk about when to switch from a compact fluorescent bulb to an LED bulb. Now you can go all green and just replace everything with LED light bulbs, but each one can cost up to like $10 each, so it can be quite expensive. Depending on what you pay for the LED light bulb, it might actually cost you more in the long run. I'm gonna concentrate on what you need to pay in order to get your maximum savings. Some people want to keep their incandescent light bulbs until it burns out until they replace it with their CFLs. It turns out that if you do that, you're actually wasting electricity. Actually, it costs you more to keep those rather than just throwing these bulbs that aren't broken and replacing them with CFLs. A typical incandescent light bulb burns about 60 watts of electricity, whereas a CFL giving the same amount of light burns about 13 watts of electricity. And then LEDs burn only about 8 watts of power giving also the same amount of light. On average, you probably use the light bulb about three hours a day, so we're gonna take that as an average. Multiply by the number of days in the year, 365, it's about 1100 hours per year. Now your electricity bill comes in a metric called kilowatt hours. It means if you burn 1000 watts for one hour, it's one kilowatt hours. A heater uses about 1000 watts of electricity. And if you run that for one hour, you multiply those together and you get one kilowatt hour. Depending on where you live, your electricity rate might differ. But over here, it's about 11 cents per kilowatt hour. That means running that heater for one hour costs you 11 cents. Now, if you have a light bulb, let's say it's very tiny, it only uses one watt, like a little night light, and you run that for 1,000 hour, that's also one kilowatt hour. And that would also cost you 11 cents. So we have all these light bulbs that outputs the same amount of light. So let's just multiply that by 1100 hours. And voila, you have the typical amount of electricity you would use per year using these kind of light bulbs. Each single kilowatt hour costs 11 cents. So we just multiply all of these by 11 cents. Now we can see that if we run the incandescent light bulbs three hours a day, every single day for the year, we would consume about $7.26 worth of electricity. Same thing for the CFL, $1.57, and LED, 97 cents. So this is a bit complicated to do every single time when you go out shopping, you don't have a pen and paper. So you can just look at the wattage of the thing itself and move the decibel place over one and add 20%. So a 60 watt is $6 plus 1.2, so that's 7.2. And for 13 watts, move the decibel over 130 plus 26 cents, $1.56, so there it is. And for eight, move it 80 cents plus uh, 16, so it's 96. So doing this in your head is a bit easier, so you just add 20%. Now you can see that if you switch over from an incandescent light bulb to a CFL, for that first year, you'll already save $5.64. A typical CFL, if you buy it for pretty cheap, it only it's only $1. So after maybe two months, you already made back the cost of the light bulb itself. This right here is a no-brainer. Now moving from CFL to LED is a little bit more difficult because you only save 60 cents per year. A typical LED light bulb might cost anywhere from $2.50 to $10. Now if you try to replace every single light bulb, maybe the fancy looking ones, it'll cost quite a bit. Now let's say the LED light bulb costs $10 to replace and you only save 60 cents per year, it'll take you 17 years in order to make back the cost of the light bulb. Actually, most of these LED light bulbs, they run for maybe only 10,000 hours, which means it will only run 10 years. 10 years in, your LED light bulb will blow and you're out $5 or so worth of investment that you put in the LED in order to save electricity. But you actually wasted money on the LED light bulb itself. Now the price of the LED light bulb is key. If it goes down to about 250, yeah, it's okay. You can you can buy it because that will only take you four years to recuperate. Running at 1,000 hours, it will only last 10 years or so. Four years in, you'll make back the cost of the LED light bulb, and the rest of the six years, you would actually be saving electricity, and you can just pocket that difference. So there's a lot of moving parts here that can change your estimate. But you can kind of know about the ballpark how much you should be spending for the LED just based on this analysis. Not all LED light bulbs are created equal. Some of them are a little bit better and they can actually use less electricity giving the same amount of light. I've seen them range from 7.5 watts to 8.5 or 9 watts. When you look for an LED light bulb, look for the lowest cost and the lowest consuming energy. Now I'm not even talking about the fancier ones where you can dim. 
those get kind of more expensive. They, they never get like the 2 250 range. Maybe in a few years they will. But right now, it's probably better to uh, stick around there. Maybe at maximum pay like $4 each bulb for them. That might be a good rule of thumb kind of thing. So I hope that shed some light on when to actually buy your LED light bulbs. Don't forget to give me a like, comment down below, and subscribe over here. Thanks for watching.